And on to the next project, the office accent wall. This is the room we started off with, pretty bland. First step, painting all the walls. Luckily, I had my partner in crime to assist in a 24-inch roller because I hate painting. The only thing I hate more is drywall. So while we're on this painting thing here, I don't know if any of you have heard, but tinting ceiling paint is an actual thing. Not something I'd recommend, but whoever built this house decided to tint the ceiling paint yellow. That's going to make for an exciting project for myself in the future, repainting the entire ceiling in the house. I'm so excited. On to the accent wall. We started off ripping down some MDF into strips and then cutting parallelograms. Yeah, I said it. Parallelograms. That high school geometry wasn't for nothing. Here, I just used the router table to round over the face edge just to get rid of that sharp line. Then used a foam roller and got them all painted black using a brush on the edges. So here's where I screwed up. I laid out the wall instead of painting it and then laying it out. You can't see it, but there's pencil lines all over the wall. The blue tape signifies where each board will go. I decided I didn't want to lay it out again so I could paint in between where each block would be. It mostly worked, but as you can see here in a minute, once we get the boards up, you can see some spots that I missed. And here comes, oh, there's one right there. Not a super big deal. I had to come back and touch up some spots anyways, but don't be like me. All right, I'll speed this up here. This is me just putting all the MDF boards up on the wall using a laser level to line up all of my points to make sure everything's level. Here's a close up of it. Yes, I'm just using hot glue to stick these boards onto the wall. Got the laser level. Should be hitting two points on the parallelogram and then the bottom point of the previous row. And here's how it turned out. Let me know what you think in the comments.